as you can see, we are in the barn at night time, having a cigar, a big one, a bomb at all, the one I normally have. Well, your request has been accepted. It has not been denied. Bought the crib about. I think we can have two weeks ago. Gotta light one up, obviously. Fire, fire. I had a cigar this Saturday and it was trash. So I was thinking of something. You know or remember Far Cry 3 with Vaz in it as the main character. I used to love Far Cry 3. I think that was one of the first games that I really played on. I think it was Xbox 360 as a kid. And it was Fallout that I got introduced to by my brother. And so to my real brother. <laughs> I 
I should have had a whiskey. Yeah, I don't like drinking alcohol. I don't like assuming it for some reason. It's just um, never been my thing, really, you know. Even though I used to really enjoy the tasting videos in once a while, while I have a tasting video. But yeah, except that I've just been, um, you know, reminiscing like, holy, sh holy crap, like, goddamn Far Cry 3. Like, if I had to choose what the best Far Cry is for me, that's difficult. It's got to be between Far Cry 3 and Far Cry 4. I really love the first one. That's like the classic one, right? There's no doubt about that. Far Cry 4 was awesome as well. With Bacon Min. Such an awesome story, right? Because I think he's actually your biological father, if not mistaken. Far Cry 5, I really liked with the, with the cult leader like Jacob and the sister and the other dude. However, with Far Cry 5, it, you know, you do one mission, you encounter a stranger. And then you add another mission to it, it gets very confusing and it's just so many things at the same time, but it's very chaotic and I love it.
so I've been waiting for five years for this piece of crap that you guys are releasing and when it got released it was bad like the game was un unfinished basically meaning you paid a hundred dollars to get a couple of days you know excess early it was crap they had a lot of bugs unfinished and in general the weird thing was people could join your game even though that wasn't a thing you wanted and even now like Fallout 76 is sometimes on discount for 20 bucks and it's like I'm not buying that piece of crap but all due respect there's no actual story what's the purpose it's buggy it's glitchy and it looks too animated for me that's why I find Fallout 3 if you want the scariest one it have to pick between Fallout 3 and New Vegas I would probably have to say first time playing Fallout 3 is very creepy because you don't know what it's about it's very new with the death closer yeah because if you remember at the beginning you go to nrc north recruitment california something right you go to that base settlement with the roller coaster everything you know and then eventually you can go to new vegas but you've got two routes you, you go like there's a road a side road with a shack in here you get a pistol a machine gun terrible gun though
Thank you all so much for watching. <clears throat>